Ah, hey Jeff. Uh, how's it going? I, uh, from this phone's portable. What? What? Ah, well. So anyway, Jeff. Phones have changed considerably over time. From the 60s to the modern day, mobile phones have become more involved in our lives, to the point where most of us cannot imagine a time without them. The first mobile phone brought many advantages and improvements to people's daily lives. Firstly, it allowed people to talk from almost any location and was wireless, so that you were not restricted to using the phone in the house. This meant that the mobile phone could be used on the way to work, in the car, on the train, allowing the people a larger degree of freedom. However, because mobile phone technology was relatively new, the mobile phone was huge and blocky compared to our small, sleek phones today. It was also very expensive, and only a few select people could afford to own them. Due to their size, they were often difficult to carry around, and using one was definitely made you stand out in the crowd. Partially due to its rarity, mostly due to its size. This isn't the first phone. It's not even particularly old, being made in the 90s but it does give an example of just how big they were compared to phones of today. The first phone was very revolutionary for its day as it allowed people to call from almost anywhere. However, there were many disadvantages of the first phone. It was very large and hard to store. Also, the battery pack was very large. Here's a brief history of phones here. Right, the first, this is the, one of the oldest phones you could find. All you could really do was ring people. And you can see it's quite big as well. It's quite hard to store. Well, this phone, on the other hand, it could text and ring people. Well, this phone, it sort of utilised the flip, the flip up like this, so it's quite easy to store in your pocket or whatever. Well, this phone, it's it text and ring that lot, but it had a camera as well, so it could take pictures of like, friends and family and holidays and things. And as you can see, the one of these more modern phones was quite thin, again, enabling easier storage. And here we have a phone which used some touchscreen, but wasn't fully touchscreen. And here we have a completely touchscreen smartphone because you're on the internet. So loads and loads and loads of music you can do almost everything on this. Mobile phones have advanced considerably since they first invented, for example. With a phone, you can call people over long distances. You can play games with the phone as well, see? No. You can play music on the phone. So of course, we can't forget the thing that started it all, the landline telephone. Ah, Jeffrey from Beautiful Abbey! What's that? What's that?